Good morning, Country Meadow leaders. Today's date is October 1st, and it's Never Ending Monday. Today's lunch menu is French bread, pizza, sweet potatoes, waffle fries, fruit salad, juice cup, and that Never Ending Monday box of milk. Today's weather report is a high of 69 and showers. This fun fact is, rats cannot burp. Today's special report is, from October 1st to October 31st, you can write a dance move that you can do in your class and your name. Make sure to drop it in the Hawk News box by the bookstore. There will be slips and pencils. These are the slips, and this is the Hawk News box. Hello, Mr. Rigo. Um, can you tell us some more things about the Boston Marathon? Sure, I would love to. Uh, the Boston Marathon is, as every marathon is, a 26.2 mile race and it is a fairly hilly course. There is one hill that they call Heartbreak Hill that uh, it's not a real big hill but it is a steady hill that you need to run up and I guess the tough thing about that is there's the Newton Hills which there's about four hills before Heartbreak Hill. So that's what makes Heartbreak Hill so difficult, I guess. Like I said, it's not a, a real steep hill, but it's just a gradual hill. And you know that you are running up a hill at that time. Um, last year, with the weather the, the way it was, um, the wind was actually up to, well, 60 miles an hour at times in your face. Not the whole way, but at times. And on Heartbreak Hill, I did see one racer that was in a wheelchair and the wind started blowing and he was halfway up and actually he ended up going backwards because of the severity of the wind at that time and I felt so bad for him but in that situation also you need to let them have the opportunity to keep on trying that's what they would want too and eventually I am sure that this person probably did make it up the hill but it was a great experience and I loved all the support that I had with it and actually look forward to uh, trying it if possible uh, again. So, thanks. Thank you. What's your favorite part about being in Country Meadow? My favorite part about being in Country Meadow are all of the teachers and all of the kids and our principal and everyone that works here. We just have the best people here and I love it. This is Hawk News, signing off.